yeah, that's the other thing, is that I can drink plenty of caffeine and then just cut intake for weeks or whatever, and I don't I don't notice any difference then either. If, um, if you say that you don't get an effect from caffeine, but you notice if you're not, you know, having caffeine, that's the same thing as having an effect from caffeine. Forty-four is fine. And that's mediocre. Really? Yeah, I mean, that's that's the caffeine keeping you at a baseline. That's not that's not the same thing as caffeine having no effect. What that means is you need to go on what a uh, an old coworker of mine described as a uh, going on a hell a day where you take a week off and you refuse to partake in any caffeine during that week and you reset your baseline oh well let's be real clear I didn't get much rest last night um, I, I didn't sleep super well um, turns out apparently so my neighbors are university, or at least one of them's a university student. And I always know when uh, when university is no longer in session. I need to time that. That neutral jump versus the full kill of that red crab at the start of, uh, of that screen. All things considered, I'm not too upset about those rocks. That is weird. So, I'm going to preface this with, I am not a doctor. However, I have been told uh, by people with uh, ADD that if stimulants help you maintain a baseline without really offering much more benefit, it might be a sign of, uh, of ADD and that that would be a good reason to uh, be tested for it. And again, not a doctor. 
Any medical advice that I can be construed as having given should be interpreted as me telling you to seek medical advice from a physician. Yo, John Carls, how's it going? John Curls, I'm not an expert, so forgive me if I'm wrong here, but it seems really weird that only your face is drunk. Isn't that usually something that's like an all-or-nothing thing? Thanks for helping clarify this. I, I really appreciate it. There we go. Lost about a quarter cycle there, just having to readjust my... Uh, my bounces before I could go full bore, but all in all, that wasn't bad. Oh, your toes are also drunk. That's probably fine then. Definitely not a doctor. I have neither a PhD nor a uh, medical degree. No, John Curls, I, I think that I've spent a lot of effort this stream um, making sure that there was no illusion that I'm a doctor, even even a little bit of one. I haven't even stayed at a Best Western Inn recently. Wait, that's not the one. What's a hotel that makes you smart? Holiday Inn, that's the one. Why? Best Western just makes you frugal. That's a very, very kind way of saying staying at a Best Western Inn makes you cheap. Um, that one's bad. This one, too. Cool. Neat. It's fine. It's fine. Okay.
That's not good. Please, just let me kill you a little. Thank you. Given that my advice boils down to go talk to a doctor, yeah, I feel okay with that. I'll take responsibility for go talk to a doctor. I feel like it's sound advice. All right, Meter81, thank you for hanging out tonight. I hope you had fun. magic so far. You know what, Skeleton? You can live. Nice. Oh, that was interesting. I'm not sure if I just didn't have a lot of health to refill, or... Or if hitting the, the screen transition right at the same time that I got the full heart skipped the animation. It's not like if that's the case, that would be something that would be reproducible in many situations, but... I'll have to check the VOD and see what happened there. my handle is, is actually a reference to my career as an orthopedic surgeon. That's well played. Well played indeed. It's fine. It's fine. Just let me go. Just let me let me go. I don't like this. I want to get off this wild ride. That was not okay. Well, that sucks. Of all the places that that could have happened, that was probably the least bad. Search and simulator stream. Not impossible. We're getting all eights so far. This is really good RNG. I don't know what's up with this, but I'm I'm into it. had one four hit the entire the entire fight that's really really freaking good okay yeah i know i apologize i know that that's like the worst possible place for the uh the camera to be during that fight oh this is not good All 
All right, everyone. I hope you're you're all ready for a really really tense next split, cause. Please, 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 please. Darn. That's fine. Fine. It's less fine, I'd like for that. Cool. Alright. Back on track. Yeah, fish can fly. Sort of. So the reason that that works is... Uh, is they added a really cool bit of movement for this game. Which causes the... Uh, the fish or the bird, whenever they are swimming or flying, um, respectively, uh, to gain just a tiny bit of height. You know, it, it makes you feel like you're kind of fighting with the, the air or water currents. Couple that with an interesting bug where they assume that you can only leave water by jumping out of it when you're swimming as the fish. So the result is that since you never hit the jump button to jump out of the water, you continue being able to gain height infinitely. So you can use that to, to do a fish fly. Seems fishy to you? That's fair. That's, it's a weird one for QA to deal with, let's be honest. a little bit short. That's fine. We're gonna be fine. I almost mashed my way into a, a heavenly shield, though. That would have been decidedly less fine.
Yeah, so that's that's a a room that you're only supposed to be able to get in the end game after you actually are supposed to have the bird. Um, so that's that's why you pick up um, the equipment that you lost, which is the uh, the heavenly sword or heavenly legendary sword. Um, you're also able to pick up the legendary armor and um, leg excuse me, legendary. Oh, that's bad. All right, that's fine. We can deal with this. Hate these snakes. So even at full health, those snakes are one-hit kills. It's fine, it's fine. Just get up. Cool. Don't care. We're good. We're doing fine. This is bad. Come on, this way. Alright, that lost a tiny bit of time, but we're still on a really okay pace. Okay, that's super bad. Alright. Okay, picking up a heart there is really good. I don't want to get the potion, but I feel like we're going to have to. It's a bummer, but it's the right move to have the, the run not die. lose half of what I've got left and then I'm going to be able to pick up a heart, I think. I think I have enough time to get to the, the guaranteed heart drop. Maybe. If you drop a heart, I'd be fine with it. Thanks. Nope. Yeah, there's no way. Either this... There it is. Darn. Oh well. Go in the door? There we go. You can drop a potion or a heart, so please do. Yo. Oh gosh, what a sketchy run so far. There we go. Right, this is a room I can just run through. Next room is a guaranteed heart drop. Or potion. I mean, this guy can drop a potion. Heart's fine.
So this is hands down the most stressful fight of the run. Oh no. Yeah. And that's why. The placement to not get hit by either the boss or the electricity is actually surprisingly tight. It's tighter than it looks. So coupled with the fact that you don't do much damage, which makes it a really long fight, it's a super, super stressful boss fight. There we go. Okay. I really want these boomerangs. Come on, there we go. I'll do my best not to lose the amazing run. Yo, I got the double hit. I got the one frame jump. This is an okay run. And I feel really sad when I throw it away. This is bad. It's fine. This is fine. And I'm going to be real honest. Less, less of the fire would be would be okay with me. It's fine, it's fine. Still fine. Alright, we're through.
Good start. Thanks, game. It's fine. It's fine. Terrible fight, but I think that we got it. There it is. <laughs> oh gosh, what a grind! Thank you for the GTs, everyone. Um, Auth, yeah, so I wasn't doing the lightning to, uh, to damage the boss. Um, the lightning is really only useful against Vampire Dragon to try and get Vampire Dragon to change its pattern. Um, optimally, you're able to get Vampire Dragon in a pattern where Vampire Dragon's going downward and you can hit it, and then RNG decides that it's going to continue going downward, and then you can hit it again, and, um, I've had one run in the entirety of of running this game where that happened but it's it's a one cycle kill in that case and it takes like six seconds and it's amazing but we lost some time there right at the end and that's a bummer but 32 14 that's that's a time i'm really happy with uh the previous world record was 32 49 so it's 35 seconds that we cut the uh, the previous world record by. <laughs> oh gosh, that last fight was really nerve-wracking. Um, the early damage was was super super disheartening. I was I was pretty sure that I was going to drop the run. No, Duango, so I I got the uh, the email to, to do the affiliate thing first day. And I have a support ticket outstanding um, wherein I requested can they can they get it set up so that uh, whatever donations I get goes straight to like Doctors Without Borders or something. I don't I don't have any problem, you know, going with a, a charity that Twitch already goes with. Um, in the meantime, and I just realized I'm not running my bot, uh, but in the meantime, I've got a, I've got a um, donate link down below where uh, people can donate to a, uh, an extra life campaign so that it can, you know, whatever money, I, I wanna be able to thank people properly, but but so that it can go to to somebody who's a little bit more in need than, uh, than someone who's got a comfy tech job. Yeah, Doctors Without Borders is awesome. Um, they're a really good choice. Um, and like I said, right now I'm, I've got the, uh, the Extra Life campaign set up so that, um, so that you know, kids are going to benefit. Kids in need. Uh, children's hospitals are definitely a, uh, a grade A uh, recipient of funds. Uh, Carter, it, wait, was this not world record? Did I did I miss that? Did somebody manage to get a run right right before I finished this run? That would be that would be a heck of an upset. That would be an amazing upset. And I will not cut out any of my commentary if that if that happened. No, it looks like meter 81 is still uh, world record at 3249. So this is the new world record. Um, minor, minor heart attack that I just had notwithstanding.
Oh, yeah, that's true. It's also a pretty sweet PB. I'm I'm definitely not unhappy with the with the PB that I got. Yeah, thanks, Dwango. Um this was a fun run. Thank you everyone for hanging out with me tonight. This was this was certainly a grind <laughs> getting this run, but I feel really, really happy with where we've got the hard category at at this point. <clears throat> yeah, Dwango, thank you so much for hanging out. I hope that you have a fantastic evening. I'm disappointed though. Like that last split really, that's that stunk. And my bird split wasn't much better. I, I'm surprised that I didn't lose time on it. I'm gonna be done with this category for now, but I'm coming back to it because this can go lower. Yeah, Dallas, thank you for the congratulations. Yeah, it's good to finally take the world record back. Um, I've, I've really enjoyed this going back and forth with Meter81. Yo, Rogue Link, thank you for the host. Um, we're going to be pretty close to winding down. What time is it? Uh, I've got, I've got time for like one more thing probably, but we're not, we're not going to be here for too, too much longer. Um, but thank you for the host. Uh, you got here just in time to see the, the new world record splits up on my screen. Yeah, no, sub sub 32 is possible. My sum of best is is accurate. I don't have any bad splits in there. So <laughs> just cut out a heart. The problem is the only heart that it would realistically save a lot of time to cut out is is dragon heart and not having dragon heart for um for the first split is is basically a guarantee that you're going to use a potion. Oh, hey, Sheepy Tina. Um, yeah, I... Hi. <laughs> Unfortunately, somebody talking to me is probably going to set off your, uh, your highlights and make you think that they're talking to you. But yeah, I think that, that Rogue Link was probably respecting the lurk there. But now your name is in the world record VOD, because I'm not going to cut the VOD until after this, so that sucks. Gamble on the potion trap. Oh my gosh. Off. Uh, that's, that's, I mean, let's be honest, that's probably where the world record's going to end up. But I don't, I don't know if, if I'm ready for that. That's a lot of, of world two resets. That's, that's super scary. Regardless, right now we we did it. We got it back. World record came back home where it belongs. So I'm uh, I'm pretty happy about that. <laughs>